You really forgot what my fists feel like, don't you? Oh. Okay, so you want to attack your girl's boss? It's not very smart, Zach. Babe, it's fine. I know how to handle mm. Aiden. Oh, I believe her. She has definitely uh, handled me before. <laughs> what? Oh, babe, 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 babe. Ooh. Get your man. Ooh. Get your man. Ooh. Boy's out of control. Mm. Now look, you got five minutes. Yeah, folks, uh, this sneak peek just now was something else. We get Hayden just on like a three minute power trip, essentially just reminding, well, actually wanting to hear the words come out of Fatima's lips that, hey, you're my new boss and I have to do what you say. And that's essential, that's pretty much what this clip is. But of course, you saw the segment where Hayden runs his mouth a little too much and uh, Zach is about to whoop his behind in the office. But um, the, regardless of how deserving he is of the you know, the whooping. Uh, I don't know about you, but I've seen Zach beat up enough people and go to jail enough times. We, we, we don't need that again anytime soon. But I think Hayden just adds the right amount of goofiness to the show. Um, you know, I know a lot of people argue that Maurice is that character, but for me, that character has fallen off seasons ago. Uh, Hayden is one of those characters where at least when he has these moments of power trips, when he finally gets his comeuppance, it actually makes it all worth it. It's like, okay, yeah, he was feeling himself, but oh, how the mighty have fallen. But it is a bit arrogant. Well, th that is the character. He's being a bit too arrogant under the assumption Andy goes down for the stabbing and, you know, then he can get rid of Fatima and whatnot. But you would think he would actually keep Fatima around just because he would, you know like that kind of thing you know having her be his assistant for however long but uh yeah it's just crazy that hayden is still on this uh this uh power trip but that's who he is as a character i mean it's just going to be something else when andy does come back and make partner he's going to be pretty screwed because we know that's what's going to happen but yeah this sneak peek was fun i think um and this is not to be political despite yesterday, last night, and waking up this morning to see what the results are. But this clip is the right amount of levity needed, given, you know, how a lot of people are feeling right now. So um, my little message of the day, keep grinding. I mean, I was up till 3.30 last night editing and posting videos. You probably noticed that you woke up to a crap ton of shorts and new content on the channel just because I had stuff to do. It's like... My attitude, regardless of who wins or loses, um, last night, I still have bills to pay. I have stuff to do, shows to review, like Sisters Tonight. Um, I want to try to squeeze in a viewing of the uh, DeVal's new Netflix Christmas film before Sisters comes on. And I did watch Papa's House episode three this afternoon. It was really good. And um, thankfully knows a team on. So basically after Sisters Tonight, once I wrap up the videos, I can do uh, my Beauty and Black content. Uh, spoiler warning, I actually have an interview with one of the cast members uh, on Friday. So I had to get ready for that. So yeah, just uh, keep your heads up. Keep moving forward. There's literally nothing else that you can do aside from doing that. And then that goes for if Harris did take the office. It's just that you got to keep moving forward. So with that being said, um, hope everybody has a great day. I really have nothing else to say other than that. Uh, please check out all the content I posted. So you, you should not be bored. There is a ton of uh, content that I just posted here. I think that for the time being, I am pretty much done with Zatima. I've broken down the season 3B trailer as much as I can. Um, so the show comes back the 26th of December. House of Pain comes back the 19th, so the week after next, that's when I can start talking about that show again. Um, so for now, it is just Sisters, uh, Papa's House, and then I want to squeeze in all my episode reviews and stuff about Beauty and the Bl Beauty and Black over the next few days. So yeah, uh, see you tonight after the episode of Sisters, which I hope is good. I honestly do hope it's good. And uh, you know, live stream around 10:05, 10:15, give or take, and I'll see you then.